Hello, and welcome back to City Skyline Mods. I've set up a street so I don't lose everything this time, so let's get into it. Um, start off with this police station. Um, looks very unrendered here, but um, that's not alias thing, that's actually how the building looks. Um, so we got this police station. Uh, Polizia. I don't know. Polizia. Um, Italian, maybe? Um, it's a nice building. It's got this road that goes under it. I always love a road inside a model. It comes with a road, I didn't have to put it down. It connects straight up to the road, which is fantastic. Um, so yeah, a very nice looking um, arch police station. Uh, here we have an university. Um, uh, an old school kind of university, like um, some sort of British university. I think Oxford looks like old red brick stuff like this. Um, over here we have a couple of signs that I would have shown yesterday or the day before whenever the video went out, um, but I completely forgot. Um, so I think the mod creators made a bunch of these. I don't know, is this actually a thing? Who knows? Uh, but he's made a few of these if you want to actually check them out. Um, over here we have a very nice park with Mother Nature in the center. Uh, these parks have a lot of extra stuff you gotta download. The Mother Nature's extra, the, I think the fountains or the bushes are extra as well. Um, over here we've got some sort of uh, resort kind of place. I should have put them on sand, but um, it doesn't have sand in it. So we've got just this, you know, very nice place for people to hang out. This would look very good on sand. Uh, Tag Memorial. Um, Tag Memorial. There's not much I can say about it. It's a tank, it's a memorial. It's a very nicely designed model as well. Uh, over here we have another kind of park that has mother nature in it. It's got these trees, these paths, this river, all these kind of things are extra um, stuff that you have to download. A bit glitchy but if you didn't put it on a slope like I did I'm pretty sure it would look fine. Um, over here Super Mall. Super Mall. You don't have malls in the UK, you've got shopping centres. Unfortunately Unfortunately it has a road, unfortunately it hasn't connected up properly and this is something that mod creators need to kind of check out that it does connect up properly on these some mods. I have downloaded a lot of things that just don't connect up to roads at all and it really kind of pisses me off because they're, they're really good models and I really want to show them off but I can't show them off if they're not actually working. But this one, it actually connects up to the road at some point just this bit, you know, have to delete the road, connect it up to that. Um, over here we have, um, I don't actually know what this is, I forgot to actually check. Um, looks like some sort of palace. I don't know, never, never seen this actual building before, but it's a nice looking building and if you're going for an old rustic, I would say Europe? No idea. Um, Gothic. Uh, not an architecturist. Ar architecture. Architecturalist. Architect. <laughs> that's that's the one I'm looking for. Here we have a building with a big crack in it. I thought this was just kind of a strange thing to add into a building. Just a big gap. But it's interesting. I like really interesting looking mods. You have to put it up against something because the sides are pretty bland. Um, over here, Tesco's 24 hours. I would have died in university if it wasn't for 24 hours. Tesco's. Um, so, <laughs> here's to all of you uni students out there that just know how useful 24 hour Tesco's is for your alcohol and food needs. Um, Plus, you know, you gotta love these kind of British, um, British kind of shops. It actually looks like a proper Tesco as well. It looks like the one in my town. 
big glass windows up front. It looks like a big warehouse inside. Great. Um, over here, we got French Butlins. Um, I think it's just kind of a Butlins type area. Or it looks like camping and shit like that. I like it. Another one that might look really good on a beach. Uh, so yeah, it's supposedly a five star resort as well. Bring your own tents, bring your own five star tents. Uh, what is this one again? I think it's another mall. Uh, mega top, mega, mega shops, stops, <laughs> mega stops. Um, this is why I don't read things while um, doing stuff. Because I just, just like I said, it's just such a pain in the ass when you are actually trying to do these kind of things. But yeah. It looks like a giant shopping centre, so I'm going to call it a shopping centre. Look at this shopping centre here. Look how nice it is. Um, it's got a Dunkin' Donuts in it, so it must be a mall. It's the American. Uh, over here, we have an indoor ski resort. I love these things. I really wish there was one close to me so I could go, go snowboarding more. There's an outdoor one that uses kind of uh, astroturf. Not as good as the indoor snowing place, and it's not going to snow here because I'm too close to the ocean, and you know, shit in Wales. Uh, over here we have uh, Basilica da Santa Maria del Mar. I actually wrote, read this one beforehand, so I know where it is. <laughs> so yeah, Basilica del Santa Maria. This Santa Maria, I guess. It's St. Mary's Basilica. I'm not actually 100% sure where Basilica is. It's some sort of church. Um, so this one's a bit low res. It might be because I've got all my settings set to low. But it might be because of the mod. No. I mean, if this is fairly high detail, this one should be. But it's, it's nice. If you see it from far, it looks like a pretty old school... Um, old school cathedral kind of thing. Uh, over here, I don't know what this is, it's just that giant dead turtle. Uh, this doesn't connect up to a road, you can just plonk it anywhere. I don't know where the entrance is or where to put any roads, so I just plonked it down, it just kind of looks cool. It just kind of looks cool. And next we have, I think, two or three more. Yeah, two here. We have this thing, <laughs> I haven't figured out what it actually does. It's some sort of water thing. I think it's um, a water pump. So it gives water, it's some sort of Icelandic hot water storage thing. Um, never knew that they need to store just massive amounts of hot water in. But I kind of guess that if you don't want your pipes to freeze over, you need to pump hot water through them. It's always a concern here when it gets cold. Oh, watch out, burst water mains and things like that. But I guess in Iceland it's just going to be a hell of a lot worse. And here we have two water purifiers. purifiers. Um, two water purifiers, they're separate buildings. But, you know, if you wanted a smaller one than these ones that I showed yesterday, um, there you go, smaller ones. And these ones kind of, I think they're kind of nicer um, and not last because I forgot to show this last time it's called an apple apple water tower very nice kind of, kind of interesting um, so yeah, apple water tower it's a water tower it looks red and last because I actually think I've actually hit everything this time this the Tesla Solar power, solar panel thing. This is crazy. It gives you so much power. I'm running my whole city off of it, um, and I have no power troubles. This is incinerated, not a. Oh my god, fire engines! Ah, that's so loud. Right, turn you down. Um, right. So, yeah, Tesla, one of the best companies to date because they're doing so many cool things. Um, space flight, 
electric cars, better electric batteries, things things that actually matter, not you know, stuff like Apple would do and build like a Ooh, look at, look at this nice watch that doesn't work on tattoos. <laughs> Um, so yeah, that's all I have for today. Um, so yeah, I've been thinking and I'm going to start doing uh, GTA mods. So I'm not sure if that's going to happen before or at the same time or a different time as or replacing a bit of City Side Island mods. So I'll have to think about that, see how hard it is to set up. Uh, GTA mods. It's not illegal to do it anymore and tomorrow's video will also be about GTA stuff. So yeah, I've been Scoop Knight, you've been fantastic. Any comments, any likes, you know where to put them. And I'll see you next time.